it, it's really important to uh, to us. I mean, it, personally, it's really important to me. I mean, I love the game of hockey, and any time that uh, we have an opportunity to to help grow the game that I love so much, uh, I think it's great. That, you know, the fact that we're able to be involved now with the junior reign and uh, to replicate a little bit what we've done with uh, with the junior kings. It, I know the most important thing, first and foremost, is the coaching. If the coaches are good and the coaches are do, delivering the right message, I know over time we're going to have a great program just like what we've done here. You call Southern California home now. As a player, you uh, have spent a lot of time here and now as a front office member. Mm -hmm. How important is the affiliation between the Kings, the Reign, the pro teams in the area and the youth hockey that's being played as well? Well, I think it's great, I mean, especially when you're a kid and you're you're able to wear the same jerseys that you see the pros that are, are wearing. I think it's a, it's a pretty cool cachet to it. But at the end of the day, I think when we have a, a system that we call the Junior Reign or the Junior Kings, we're able to go get coaches that maybe other uh, organizations wouldn't be able to get. And uh, like I said earlier on, the coaching is very important. If we can get the right coaches, usually they'll make the players better, they'll make sure they have a better experience and they have more fun. And over time, you know, you'll be able to create better players and they have better experiences. Something we knew we wanted to do from day one is get the rain connected to the local hockey community on a bigger level. And, you know, we, we found the right partner. That was, a, that was a key to making this a success. And, you know, it, it's, we have that partner who's doing it the right way. So it was uh, making those connections, sitting everyone down, making sure everyone had the goal of building the sport of hockey locally and doing it under the Kings and the Rain brand. When the youth player gets to put on that, that Kings uh, shield on their sweater or the Rain shield in this case with the Junior Rain, you know, how does that enhance their experience just in youth hockey in general? You know, it, it's, we as the Kings and the Rain, you know, we, we, we want to work hand in hand with the local hockey community and you know, to us, anytime a kid out there has our their logo, our logo on their their jersey, you know, it's a uh, uh, it's a source of pride. It's, I know it's a source of pride for the kid, but it's also a source of pride for us. So it's one of those things where, um, you know, just giving them that connection to the Kings and the Rain is just a fantastic opportunity. You're always involved in hockey development with the Kings and with AEG as the organization. Just in general, you, you've been with AEG for a while. What does it do for a youth hockey organization to have a player appearance from the local team? Well, you know, anytime the the bigger clubs have the opportunity to interact with the local hockey community, it, it's just a, it's a win-win. The kids get that connection to the pro players. They they can see their their future in that player as they come out, and then the big club you know gets to give back to the community, and that's what you know the Kings are all about, and and the Rain, and it, that's why we do these things is to give back to the local hockey community.